All right, well, here is mathematical operations with significant figures in a nutshell. If I can get this thing to work. Okay, so when completing math, math, math calculations, the final answer must be reported and rounded to the appropriate number of significant digits or significant figures. The answer is rounded according to the last mathematical operation completed. You use PEMDAS. Okay, PEMDAS. Okay, so some rules. Complete calculations following to the order of operation. That's your PEMDAS. Two, if the final step is multiplication and division, look at each value given in the problem and find the one with the least number of significant figures. Round the final answer to the same number of significant figures. <clears throat> okay, do not round until the final step. That is key right here. Okay, so multipl multiplication and division examples. Okay, so here's what we have. We have um, two, uh, I mean, two numbers with three significant figures each. When we multiply it, we end up with this answer here. Okay. However, we need to round it because there's only three significant digits here and three here. So we want our answer in three significant digits. So we go, we count one, two, three. So there's one, two, three. We're going to look at this number right here. <clears throat> and we're going to decide whether to round it or not. When we do that, it's going to round this nine to a zero and this five to a six and so there's our final answer okay and here is a div division you have three significant digits here four here remember these zeros don't count so we have four and three so our final answer is going to be in three significant digits so you have one two and three now in order to get three significant digits, <clears throat> you have to either add zeros or go to scientific notation. Why? Because these, di these digits don't count. So you can also do scientific notation where you do, <clears throat> excuse me, 1.86 times 10 to the 1, 2, 3, fourth power. So you can do any of these, either this one, in expanded or standard and this in scientific okay but again we started with three and four so we're going to go with the three it's the least adding and subtraction this order gets a little bit different complete calculations fo following order of operations if the final step is addition or subtraction only consider digits to the right of the decimal okay determine the fewest significant figures to the right of the decimal Round your answer to that number of significant figures. So, for instance, here we have um, two five point four. I'm not sure where that came from, but anyway, we have this fifteen minus, and then we have uh, two. Oh, okay, sorry, take it back. All right. I don't know where this, okay, so here we have it lined up. So you have one significant digit after the decimal, two, and two, okay? Here we have three, four, and so our answer is going to be in three, okay, after the, de after the decimal. Here we have one significant digit after, so we're cutting the zero off, and there's our answers. Had to think for a minute, so. So if you had 2.300 plus 5.2 equals, okay? Here we have four significant figures, and here we have two significant figures. I'm sorry, take it back. One significant, three significant figures, and one significant figure. It's been late, sorry. So our answer needs to be in one significant digit, but you do it at the end, okay? So you add these together, 
and I'm going to go ahead and put 5.2, so we end up with 0, 0, 5.7, so my answer is 7.5, one significant digit, okay? All right, have a good night, guys.